Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do your daily vibes for July 25th. This is a daily reading. I don't know who it's going to be for. This is a message from my guides for you. Um, this is not sign specific, so it's not particular to one sign, and it's not time specific, even though I am recording this for July 25th, 2019. We're going to use the Vice Versa deck. There's card, there's uh, illustrations on both sides. So anything that comes out reversed, it's it's not going to be reversed because it's, you know, there's two meanings on each side. So we're going to get one of these. We're going to get one of these. But we're going to cut this deck right here. I, mean, I decided to do it on camera. I usually do it. Sometimes I do it out, off the camera. Um, but I decided this time I'm going to do it on the camera. So uh, let's see what we get. And then we'll break into the other ones. Just for like an overall energy. Oh, we got a battle here. Five of Wands. We definitely have a battle. We have, this is a battle. It's a fight. This There's some tension. There's probably going to be some sort of explosion. Okay? You know, like something is about to eru er erupt. Erupt. Did you get that? Erupt. So yeah, something is about to explode. Um, it may not, these people don't even see it. it. They may not even see it because they're so caught up in whatever they're doing, trying to prove themselves in this competition. So there's definitely some sort of competition. There's some sort of conflict. Other people are watching, but it's like they're all, they're focused on Winning. We got somebody here that is focused on winning. Winning this competition. Meanwhile, in the background, something is about to explode. So be prepared. Something is about to explode. We have the Empress here. The Empress gives birth to a new life. You know, she's got a star above her head. So she's been wishing for something. She's watching. She's She probably knows. This woman is very experienced. This person is very experienced. She must, she's probably watching. She's probably watching this and sees that something is going to explode. She's waiting. She's waiting to see who's going to win. That's what's happening. She's waiting to see who's going to win. Anyhow, so the overall energy is something is about to explode. Okay? Might have to do with an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. It may. Could have to do with a Taurus or a Libra. Doesn't have to be. But this is... This is This is Venus. This is about love. This does have to do with love. There's competition. There is some comp. This is a competition. We, we may have two people that are competing for this person. This is also a mother. Okay, this is a mother. So this could be a mother that is watching her children fight or watching something. I don't know what she's watching, but... This is a very wise individual that knows this one. She knows that something is about to happen. Okay. And anyway, we're going to put the cards back together and we're going to get some of these. Oh. Let's get one of these. Ooh. The world. So yeah, we do have a new beginning here. Something is coming to an end. Maybe the competition is coming to an end. Right? Something. This is the end of a journey. It's the end of a chapter. It's the end of the phase. Somebody has graduated. This is a lesson being learned. Crossing that bridge. So somebody is about to step into a whole new world. That's what this is. It's a, it's a major completion. So something is ending, something big is ending, and somebody is about to 
I see things differently, put it that way. They're about to embark on a new journey. It's a huge completion of something. I don't know, we need to get a lot more cards. This is a new beginning as well. When one thing ends, usually something new begins, right? This is success. Somebody has successfully learned something. They've been fighting a very good battle. That's for damn sure. They've been fighting a really good fight. With that five of wands. It has. It's been a really good fight. But it's over now. And there's about to be some sort of. I think it's upheaval. Moving on. Six of swords. Moving to a better place. This could be moving as well. Somebody is probably moving. Or they're thinking about moving. Or they're just thinking about leaving something behind. That is over. It's over. There's somebody is moving to a better place. Period. Whether they're physically moving or they're mentally moving or whatever it is. This is a rite of pass passage. It really is. It is Mercury retrograde, so forgive my speech. <laughs> Anyhow, this is moving to a better place, leaving the trouble behind, leaving the past behind. So yeah, we got somebody that is moving on. They're moving to some place. <sighs> Very different from where they've been. Okay. Travel. There's definitely some travel here. This is basically traveling to a new destination. We got this giver of life here. Hmm. There's that battle again. Well, geez, I guess we're going to get all the same cards. Um, I'm going to lay it <laughs> It wanted to flip. <laughs> I can't make the shit up. This mother may be turning her back. <laughs> I don't know. This could be a wife. This could be a girlfriend. I don't know. We're going to stop right here. Oh, look at that. Yeah, there's definitely a battle going on here. <sighs> Ooh, judgment. <clears throat> So yeah, we we definitely have an end end of suffering, the end of pain. We have the birth of a new life. The suffering is over. Somebody has reached rock bottom. That's rock bottom of the ocean. I mean, this is rock bottom. Somebody has hit rock bottom, and now they're about to have a rebirth. This is like being born again, starting fresh. I'm serious. Maybe they're going to come together with their perfect match. We have the yin and yang here. They've been waiting for this moment. This is like when I see the star or the star card or stars, I think of your prayers being answered. Somebody's prayers are probably going to be answered because they decide to move on. They decide to end the suffering. This is the end of suffering. It's the end of conflict. It's the end of this long, hard battle. It's the moment that somebody has been waiting for, getting prepared for. That is the three of wands. But this is the five of cups. This is grieving. This is sadness. Carrying a heavy burden, carrying a heavy load. We have somebody here that has been overwhelmed. <laughs> Confused. Losing focus, losing concentration, trying to prove themselves. Working very, very hard. 
to hide their pain. To hide their pain. But I feel as though whoever this person is, this is being reborn again. It absolutely is. Anyway, whoever this person is, I feel like this person <coughs> is deciding to... It's like they they get this new passionate opportunity. This is this is this is a, a a passionate new start, a passionate new vision. This is a vision. They get this vision. Here they're blind. They've been blinded for quite some time. This person you see they're blind. You, you I don't know, you can't really see the eyes with this camera. And I don't know how to focus it in and I know I don't like to read books. So anyway, the, the, somebody has been blinded, okay? They they've been blind. And I'm, and I'm not trying to mock anybody that is, okay? But we have somebody here that hasn't been able to see. They haven't been able to see clearly, okay? Somebody hasn't been able to see clearly, you know? Maybe their vision has been clouded, you know? They haven't been able to see, you know, their truth. They've been living in some sort of fantasy. They've been living in some sort of illusion, their vision has been skewed. But now they got this new passionate opportunity. Or they have this new vision. The Ace of Wands is a vision. That is time to let go. It's time to let go of this burden. It's time to let go of this weight. So this is a heavy weight. Somebody may be... They have made, somebody may have gotten some sort of epiphany, some sort of a wake up call that, you know, I got to lose weight for some of you. This is about, this could be about losing weight for some of you. Um, this is a wake up call. This is, this is an epiphany. This is a revelation that, you know, I need to stabilize. I need to be practical. I need to be responsible. I need to focus. I need to get moving. Somebody has been stagnant. Somebody has been stalling. And it's like now they get this new vision, this new exciting opportunity, this new new exciting vision. Okay, that's what this is. That they have they they were they weren't seeing it in the past. This is an opportunity to to live again with the judgment card. This is an opportunity to start over, to have a whole new life. So I feel like we have somebody here that is has hit rock bottom in their life and they're ready for their new life. They're ready for their resurrection. They're ready to live again. So I feel like we have a birth here. We have a we have the birth of something new that you have been waiting for. This could be somebody arriving. Okay, because this is an arrival, the three of wands. This could be a perfect match. There could somebody, you know, could somebody could arrive that really completes you. Somebody has been feeling incomplete. Now, you know, somebody arrives and you feel the passion, you feel the connection. This could be a new sexual partner coming into your life that is going to help you heal from your past burdens, from you know, the, the the grief that you have suffered. There's been some sort of grieving. There has. I feel as though, if not, there's going to be. Because this is grieving. This is sadness. So, but this is a passionate new start that somebody just couldn't see. They just couldn't see the opportunity. But it's like now they see it. Now they wake up and they see the opportunity. This is what this is. This is a golden opportunity. They've stalled and they've waited for so long, but now they see the opportunity. This is an opportunity that can grow. This is an, a passionate beginning. So I feel like we have somebody here that was trying to prove themselves. 
by holding on to something, definitely trying to prove themselves. Somebody was probably holding a grudge or carrying some burden or, you know, burying themselves in their work to hide their true feelings, to hide their pain. But now it's like they can't live this illusion anymore. Now it's like they wake up. Now their eyes just open and they see. They see. They see the opportunities like they, they do. So I feel like this empress, she's been waiting. Like I said at the beginning, she's been waiting for an arrival. We have somebody here that has been struggling. This is power struggles, been struggling. This person has been struggling to release their grudge or release their burden. And they've been grieving and they've been sad. And it's like all of a sudden they wake up and they decide to get moving. So be prepared. Be prepared. Get prepared. Something is arriving that you wished for. I don't know what it is. I don't really feel the need to go any further. If this is the end of suffering, get prepared for a new life. She, the pain and suffering, once the pain and suffering is over, what happens? She gives birth to a new life. Okay? So, yeah. We got a new life here. We have a new beginning here. It's a blessing. It's a wish being fulfilled. It's a freaking miracle. She gives birth to a miracle. This is a perfect match. This is going to help you. It's going to make you feel alive again. It's going to wake you up. It's going to wake up the passion inside of you. Not only is it going to do that, it's going to be solid. It's going to be stable. It's what you've been waiting for. I mean, I can't. I don't feel a need to go any further. I'll get one of these real quick. And I don't think that's it. Light. Imagine yourself as a being composed of energy and light. Because in reality, that's precisely what you are. You are a powerful being and people are attracted to your brilliance. This is a time to remember how vibrant you truly are. And that is what the, somebody is, is see, getting a new vision. And they are about to resurrect from the ashes. I can't make this shit up. It is what it is. So get prepared. Get prepared. Something is arriving that you have been waiting for. It could be a new partner. It could it could be a reconciliation. With this judgment card, there could be a reconciliation here. Somebody is about to have a wish granted. The pain, I think the pain is over. That's what I got. Good luck.